scientist has taught various artificial intelligence learning algorithms how to flirt, resulting in peculiar responses. Janelle Shane, a research scientist from Colorado, trained four versions of the GPT-3 artificial intelligence, Da Vinci, Curie, Babbage, and Ada, to generate pickup lines. The way that neural networks, which are networks similar to the connections in the human brain, such as this learn things is by matching patterns in speech and language. This is how they create content that seems similar to that a normal human, but without any understanding of the text's meaning. GPT-3 has previously been used to design websites, write stories, and has capably disguised itself as a human on the internet. Da Vinci, which Shane describes as the largest and most competent of the variants, came up with these suggestions. So, these are the top pickup lines of 2021 from Da Vinci. Amaze your crush and get results. You have the most beautiful fangs I've ever seen. You have a lovely face. Can I put it on an air freshener? I want to keep your smell close to me always. I love you. I don't care if you're a doggo in a trench coat. I have exactly four stickers. I need you to be the fifth. You know what I like about you? Your long legs. I once worked with a guy that looked just like you. He was a normal human with a family. Are you a normal human with a family? You look like a stealth assassin from the clouds. Do you like pancakes? Out of curiosity, did you know that? You can sip and snort pumpkin spice lattes. You look like Jesus if he were a butler in a Russian mansion. So, these are the responses of Da Vinci AI algorithm. Curie, the second variant, was the closest to depressing online pickup line lists. Babbage, a smaller version of the GPT-3 algorithm, seemingly did not understand what the concept of a pickup line. Ada, the smallest of the variants, came up with unintelligible suggestions, such as embroidery tags and limit to one purchase in stores, and future Pop-Tarts by Tracy Thorne. While the artificial intelligence may not be able to flirt effectively, its use in online dating is one that some countries is already experimenting with. Japan's government is attempting to use artificially intelligent matchmaking systems to help people find matches in order to tackle the country's declining population, but the systems are usually too simple to get results. Even in-home assistants, such as Amazon's Alexa or Google's Assistant, have the capability to analyze relationships. A study by Imperial College Business School suggests that these assistants will develop to eventually predict the likelihood that a relationship could be successful and learn how to intervene in heated arguments. So guys, what do you think about AI flirting? Share your thoughts down in comment section and don't forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get instant video notification. So guys that's it for now, see you in next video.